of your studio I come with a new tutorial and this tutorial is about how to make a pop-up contact form in WordPress and for this we will need two plugins and one is contact form 7 and another is easy fancy boxes let's install them in our site first contact form 7 we just go plugins install plugins then add new then I will search for contact form 7 It will take few seconds. Then install installing. Then activate. Then I will uh, install Easy Fancy Box. The same way. Easy Fancy Box. This is Easy Fancy Box. If you take this Easy Fancy Box just installing it and activate it so our two plugins there one is contact form 7 and another is um, easy fancy box our first condition is fulfilled and now start work uh, with it um, and now if we start working with it if you check if you install contact form 7 there is uh, a contact form a contact menu options on the left sidebar and if you click on it you will see a automatic contact form is created and uh, here is a shortcut too we just need this shortcut we just copy it and we just put it here like this this is the shortcut we get it from there so uh, now we already collect the shortcut here and in your contact form 7 make a form you can add new for uh, i mean new field or not i have a tutorial about this uh, you can check this too i will add it to description and uh, this is how you write code for pop-up I mean uh, for fast method uh, so first method is we will use text to uh, so this uh, you can use uh, contact text uh, I mean here is the text here you can use text here you just copy it like this full text I will give this on description and uh, one thing uh, I have to tell you that you just put your contact test here and everything will be same just put your shortcut inside it I mean this is put your shortcut here so I will put my shortcut here I just copy it and paste it here yes this one paste it here so it is ready I just copy it fully and I will make a paste uh, called contact uh, contact form and just in text field I will just add this code you see I have added this code and just update it yes so our code is added to our uh, I mean page and uh, let's see it is working or not so um, now we will uh, click view page and uh, here is my view page and you see here is a contact us text here so um, you can ask me why it is on top it is for CSS issue you have to fix it uh, according to your need uh, with the CSS uh, I just have to show you how it is working so if you click on it you will see contact us is working uh, but one thing remember you have to load the page fully then you will s uh, clicking on it so you just use and here is the close button so this is how your uh, contact us button is uh, work I mean um, pop-up is working so for uh, here is other two method here I mean uh, you can use it uh, either as uh, I mean a button you just put your button code here I mean button code you can make a button and uh, up, uh, upload it on media folder and just put it images src like something like this I am so I just uh, add a put a button code here I mean uh, this is the one of the site and uh, here is the code button code let's see it is working or not we just copy fully again like this I will give this on your you just have to put your um, I mean uh, button uh, I mean button URL here and I hope you already know how can put it so I just copy it and I just paste it again uh, let uh, sorry let me paste it again here is the button code I taking from so just replace this one and place this one so update it and let refresh it Yes, this is the contact from button is here and click on it and yes it shows that yes it's uh, it is working and you can ask me why it is bar here you can do fixing it with uh, your CSS so I don't have to talk about this so uh, um, so this is pop-up is working fine uh, for two method and the last method is 
if you use PSP code inside, I mean, you used to PSP code like PSP do a uh, eco do short code, uh, and you want to put it like a he top header or anything, then you will use uh, this code for uh, using it. So, here are some solutions, and if you use, uh, I mean, use page builder element like raw HTML as. Uh, um, the visual composer has uh, raw HTML. Then fix will be just change fancy box into class fancy box inline to auto close after form settings. And uh, you see right now auto close is not working, and you have to close it after sending form. But if you wish to put auto closing, you just press on send OK on uh, contact form setting additional settings. I am showing it here. So contact form and go for contact form. And the existing contract form, click on it. Uh, we are working with this contract form, and this is the additional settings. And you just put this code here. So, this uh, one minute. So, it shows uh, depreciated settings are using. Um, so, uh, I mean, here is some issues here. You just put codes here, okay, send okay, and the fancy box parent close, and uh, this will work fine for you. So, this is how you can make a uh, pop up contract form. Mm, uh, uh, in WordPress and uh, if you have any questions you can ask me in comment uh, but I will suggest you uh, to check my contact form um, uh, 7 how to make a contact form in contact form 7 this type of tu tu tutorial uh, I will give you uh, give everything in my description to check carefully and uh, I hope this will solve all of your uh, pop-up contact form issue thank you for watching take care bye bye